anime where the main character is betrayed and comes back overpowered. I've been wanting to talk about this one for so long, so with that, let's get right into it. Ninja Fusion, adventurers who don't believe in humanity will save the world. You have a whole main character cast that is full of people who have been betrayed and do not believe in humanity, like it says in the title. They have been betrayed by people they care about or even trusted, and somehow all find each other, and as the story progresses, you find out they start restoring their faith in humanity, and they start to be able to trust again, and it's so beautiful. This is a very underrated action and fantasy anime that a lot of people haven't been talking about. I highly recommend you watching this anime if you want to know where it's at it's on crunchyroll chilling in my 30s after getting fired from the demon king's army you have a main character who's the lead of the demon lord's army and who's been there for so long that he is just the man until his stepbrother takes the throne and fires him it's kind of like a cinderella story almost after being banished he goes on a journey of self-reflect and finds himself a woman who needs rescuing but at the same time this is where he learns his true power because when he was in the demon lord's army he didn't really have power no he thought he had demon lord power no no he has something different when he learns what his true ability is his aura is to the max I'm talking about actual aura. So when he does face his stepbrother again, he is fully overpowered and ready for the fight. So if you know where this anime is streaming at, it's on Crunchyroll. The Kingdoms of Ruin. This anime I have started recently, and yes, I know what's going to happen in the second half. We all know how it do. But I don't care because you have an anime with the first episode leading you up so much. It's you so hooked that you have to know what happens to the rest. It doesn't matter whether it goes up or down. You need to know what happens. Now, those who've seen the anime knows exactly what I'm talking about by the betrayal because it was going to be the thumbnail of this video, but I did not want to do any spoilers. But you have a main character who's put through that torture that pain that suffering wields it uses it as a power and becomes completely overpowered this is it if you don't know where this anime is at it's on crunchyroll